Hey everybody, uh, I know it's been a, been a while since I've uploaded something, but, uh, you know, I've been kind of busy, uh, but I have some, some free time, so I figured I'd just play something, and, uh, I've been playing a lot of Dark Souls, uh, so it's, it's, you know, it's pretty short, if you, you kind of know what you're doing, uh, so I was just like, ah, screw it, I'll just, I'll just record it, because I've got, I've got some time, so, uh, yeah, we're just gonna do it, we're just gonna be a very standard run, uh, I actually did this a little while ago um can't create any more characters oh yes okay yep there it is right there okay <laughs> pretty much just gonna do the same thing I always just do it my uh, my name pretty much oh whoop. what the oh I have to there we go I have to select it okay I pretty much always just do this because it doesn't matter what your character looks like uh, in this game, uh, because they always they just look like a gross zombie in the end anyway, just all like ninety percent of the time. So I'm just gonna go warrior with the master key because why would you not go with the master key? And yeah, that's that's as much as I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna skip this. Also, I apologize, um, because I mean this is this gonna be in 720p. Um, I'm gonna skip cutscenes because um, I just am. Um, and uh, as I, as I said, I've been I tried this like yesterday, but um, things were really, really, really fucky. Um, the audio was super off. I was recording at 1080p, 60 frames per second, um, and uh, I recorded like two hours and. Uh, then whenever I exported it as an MP4, which is the only way that you can export as a uh, in using uh, Elgato, uh, the audio was way off sync, and I was like, "Well, shit, maybe I'll fix it in Premiere." So I put it in Premiere, and the audio was even more off sync. And I tried to match it up, but it kept just getting off sync. So I was just like, "Ah, fuck it," and I just deleted the whole thing. So we're just gonna try again. Luckily, I didn't play for too long. Um. So I am I am recording at 720 because I, I watched a video where uh, someone who was having the same problem recorded at 720 instead of 1080 and that worked. Um, so I'm just gonna do that. I tested it. I did like I played for like it's five to ten minutes. Uh, I recorded it. I exported it as an as an MP4 and the um, the audio was not uh, off. So, hopefully that will just continue to be uh, how it is, and it's not like, oh, you have to you have to do at least, you know, 15 minutes. Why am I attacking you with the crappy weapon? Okay, there we go. Hello, lad. Goodbye, lad. Yeah. So, I'm, I'm just gonna do, like, a, just a very basic run, pretty much. I'm just gonna get, uh, like, Claymore. It's probably... I like that weapon a lot. Um, I'm just gonna use that. Hey, buddy. Regrettably. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You can die now. There he goes. Okay. I also really like the Iaito. It's like a katana in this game. Uh, I've been watching a lot of uh, Lobos Jr. play. Wait, oh good Jesus, dude. Alright, calm the hell down. There we go. Okay. I'm watching a lot of Lobos Jr. Uh, play this game. He does a lot of uh, challenge runs, if you don't know. He plays a lot of a lot of games, but like he's most known for like playing Dark Souls with like challenge runs. Like um, like New Game Plus 7 Fist Only. Uh, uh, this will not be a crazy run like that. And I will probably never, ever, ever do a crazy run like that. But if you're interested in seeing something like that, he's got loads of runs for like Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 2, Dark Souls 3, and Bloodborne, and uh, Sekiro, which I haven't played Sekiro yet, but I kind of want to. I just haven't got around to doing it yet. Hey, buddy. See, I'm, I'm trying to... I remember whenever I was playing this before, I was kind of like explaining things just in case some people don't know. Oh, also, uh... There we go. Okay. And I'm gonna forget if I have or have not explained something. I don't think I really need to. Hey, I got two hits on. Good. 
This is the first boss. He's, um... Uh-oh. Oh no, he hit me. There we go. He's not so bad. But yeah, uh, I guess I'll just, I, I'm just, I just assume that like most people kind of know Dark Souls. I think mean, it's probably just because I've been watching a lot of challenge runs and stuff. But uh, yeah, uh, if you two hand your weapon like this, you do more damage. So whenever I parry someone, I switch to two hands so I can get more damage on the repost. In case you didn't know. I, I don't know. Um, we don't need those guys right now. There's little crow guys over there that'll give you stuff. Or they'll trade you stuff. So we don't um, want to do that. Skip! These cutscenes are all, all over everywhere. You can find them if you look hard enough. Um... And a level of strength. And then, like, vitality, I guess. I don't know. This is Fire Lake Shrine. <laughs> Just your stock standard hub area. Nothing crazy here. Yeah, and the reason why I took off my clothes, or most of them, is so that I could uh, fast roll, which fast rolling uh, gives you the most uh, invulnerability frames. Also, what am I doing? There's a better thing to do. Wait, can I even... Oh yeah, 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 you can, you can. Okay. Um... Yeah, yeah. And there's also this guy right here who... He's a really nice guy. You should trust him and, uh... Uh, he can't do... He, he can do no wrong. Just trust me. He's a great guy. I'm sure he's got a very long life ahead of him. So we're just gonna let him be. We're gonna fall. Oh no! Okay. Hey, look at that. This little thing. Now, I really only want to come here for uh, these homeward bones. Homeward bones will transport you to the last bonfire you went to. So I really only need those because I don't need any of this. But uh, they're here, and I see them, and they're shiny. So I'm gonna pick them up because I can't not do that. Um, I'd be a terrible speedrunner at this game because I'd, I'd I'd pick up all the stuff. This is why I went this way, because I'm going to end up over here anyway. And uh, I don't need this, so I'm going to pick it up. I mean, it's not bad. Anyway, we are not going to get that. I am going to get this, for no reason. We're not going to be Giant Dad, though. I'm sorry. Uh, we're just going to pick up what we really need, these binoculars, and let's see if I can make it back. Without dying. I could have just jumped off there, but... Because I really don't need to, like, keep these souls safe. Also, giants... You know what? Fuck it. We'll get it from this. Why not? Uh, I really just needed the binoculars. Absolutely needed the binoculars. You'll see why uh, at some point. But they're a very necessary item. Um, now... I actually don't know what this is. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Are there boners following me? No? Hot damn. Oh, look at that. Typically, they follow you all the way back to the bonfire, but uh, I guess not this time. But yeah, um, I don't know. I really hope that this doesn't get fucked up, because, uh, well, I mean, typically you, you hope that most things don't get fucked up, because it's typically a bad thing. But yeah, I, uh, when you... I'm just gonna go grab a couple things real quick before I start going kind of like the the normal way. I won't be going the complete normal way that like a first time player would be going because I have access to a couple uh, different things because I got the master key. Um, so I'm going to be making use of that. Okay. Just gonna grab that. And let's see. Yeah, why not? Okay. I was debating. There's a thing I could go get. I'm gonna go get it. Let's see if I can open that door. Haha! <laughs> mm -hmm. 
and go to the Valley of the Drakes. Interesting little tidbit. Uh, drakes apparently are like they're like. I guess I should first explain what a dragon technically is, because this is just something that I have learned. I picked up. Well, okay, I I, I was curious because people were saying that there was a difference between like drakes and and wyverns and whatnot. Is this what? No, it's not. Okay, good. If you pick up one of those things, I don't know which one it is. It pisses him off, and you don't want to do that because he's a son of a bitch. Um, but if you just pick that up, it's fine. Um, the dragons have four legs and two wings. Um, wyverns have two legs and two wings. So these right here, this is technically a wyvern. And a drake is a dragon without wings. So just four legs. Oh, I'm not... I'm not gonna get red tear stone ring. I'm, I'm not confident in my skills enough to do, like, a red tear stone ring stuff. Um, so... I'm just going this way. It's just something that I'm gonna go grab real quick. Or at least I hope it'll be real quick. Um, I mean, uh... There's two things I can do. I'm gonna rest at the bonfire. It's fine. I'll be able to run back, no problem. Hey, there you are. Oh, jeez, dude. Alright, I need you to attack me. Ah, damn it. That's not... that's not right. Alright, uh... Here, face me. Uh, not quite. Go oh, shit. Oh, no! That's why I got the bonfire. Okay, I'm glad I got that bonfire now. Oh no, my 85 souls, they're gone. How will I ever get them back? Alright. Damn, dude, come on. Be nice to me. You are just really not... You're not facing the right way, dude. That works. Ah, shit. That, oh, that's fine. That's perfect. Alright, get out of here. Boop. Wait, he fell, right? Okay, good. <laughs> Alright. No halberd, but I just wanted the shield. There we go. This grass crest shield uh, is the best shield. Definitely, 100%. Because uh, you uh, regenerate uh, stamina faster when, when wielding it. So, it's pretty good. There's just one other thing I'd like to grab real quick. And then we're going to hoof it back to Firelink. Um, it's here, right? Where is it? Somewhere? Oh, hey, well, there's this dude. I will, I will kill him real quick. Alright, two, two large shards. It's not terrible. I prefer a chunk, but... Is it... Am I drunk? Oh, there it is. It's down there. Okay, well... <laughs> Alright. I mean, I guess I could just go this way. Here we go, we want this, just because we want the bow, and this armor is fairly light, so I can probably wear it and still... No? Oh, damn. Okay. The gloves? Oh, no, the gloves and the pants weigh 2.8... 2... Okay. How about that? Damn! Okay, alright, never mind then. We're gonna need a little endurance before we do that. Or, well, something else, but, um. Yeah, I could go that way. 
Nah. I'll run through the berg the normal way. Besides, I can't really take on the, uh, the guy in there at the moment. I mean, I could. It'd be really boring, though, so... It's just a big dude in there with a lot of armor. Yeah. But yeah, I got Grass Crest. Uh, this will pretty much be the only shield that I ever use. Actually, eh. Maybe not, because this shield does not have 100% physical block. Uh, which basically means... Wait, hang on. This is not running through the berg the normal way. <laughs> Gosh, damn it. Okay. I'm trying to run back. I'm trying to remember the way to run back, and it's through the little cave. It's not that way. I could go that way. But! I'm not gonna do that. Yeah. Which means it doesn't block a hundred physical percent of the damage. It only blocks 95 percent of the damage. I think that's how it works. It just doesn't block all of it. So if I'm blocking and someone hits me, I'll still take a little damage. But if I had a hundred percent fizz block, then I would take no damage. The only thing that would happen is my stamina meter would go down. Unless the attack was so strong that it just depleted my entire stamina bar and still hit me anyway. That's uh, so also if, if an enemy has, like, electricity or fire on their attack, then that will bleed through, even if you have 100 fizz block. So. Probably never gonna use that elevator again. Um. Hmm. See you. What's up? What are you gonna do? Okay, good. Good, good, good. See you later, nerds. I'm out of here. Also, just let my stamina run out completely like a noob. That's not good stamina management. Now, this guy doesn't activate. He only activates when you either hit him or if you take his stuff, right? His sp one of these, one of those two. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. We don't, we don't need what he has, so we're just going to leave him be. So we're just running back this way. Oh, there... Uh, mm, okay. There... Mm, I, I don't feel like having to do that again. Yeah, alright, hang on. Give me a second. I should just do that anyway. Did I send this elevator back? Did I ever... Oh, no, this isn't an elevator. Okay. New Londo Ruins. Okay, there's just one thing we need to quickly grab while we're in here. Oh, wait, no! That's bad. Okay, uh... Not risking it. Never mind. The last bonfire that I rested at was not Firelink, so that would be very bad, actually. Okay. Never mind, we're going back to Firelink. We're gonna just come back down here real quick after, because I just want to spin these souls, because it's very, very likely that I will die doing what I'm about to do. So. Oh, okay. I, did, I sent it back up like a good, good, like a good boy, but little did I know that I actually would be taking the elevator back up. I just hate being a gross zombie the whole game. This does not... I don't like that. Is that just... I know that a lot of people like to do, like, the... Um... Like, gross-looking characters. Like, they just, like, really fuck them up. Like, they go to the face options. Or, like, they make their, like, skin, like, blue or something. And then, like... They go to, like, the face options and just keep on clicking, like, this option that, like, creates a similar face. And it just, like, morphs the face into some gross, disgusting thing. Uh, and I get, I get it, I get it. It's funny and everything. That's, um... Eh. I think 16 is the amount of strength that I need to use the Claymore, so we'll just do... Vitality. Okay. I don't care if I lose this amount of souls. It's fine. 
Alright, so... Now we just have one more errand to run real quick. And then I'll start playing the game, I swear. And I don't remember what I was talking about. Oh yeah, gross zombie. Yeah. People like to like make their skin blue and like do the fuck up face, fucked up face. And, uh, yeah, no, I get it, it's funny, but um, it's just not really my thing. Uh, to be honest, I don't expect to live, so let's just send that back up. Did I get that already? Yeah, alright. Um, yeah. And it like almost seems like it's like, like you have to, because it's like every like YouTuber or Twitch streamer, whenever there's like a character created in one of these games, it's always just like, let's make something stupid and name it like... Uh, I don't know. Just name some stupid name. And it's like... Again, I get it. It's like, oh, it's funny. But it's like, everybody does that. It's kind of like one of those things that, um... There, there are a couple things. And by a couple, I mean literally a couple. Just like two things. I'm sure there's more, actually. Let's see if I can run past these guys. Oh my... Oh, no, nope. Alright, whatever. <laughs> I almost did it. That's okay. Oh no, my 318 souls. Uh, like, uh, but like a lot of things that just like generally, just like YouTubers, like Twitch streamers, like, like, uh, like if they play Breath of the Wild, they will always. It's almost like it's required. Always make a joke about how they. Oh, wait, um, they always make a joke about how they're going to do a no clothes run. Like when they start the game, it's like I'm gonna do yeah, I'm gonna do a no clothes run, I'm just gonna have Link be naked the whole time. And then like five minutes later, like I ah, just kidding, I'm gonna put clothes on. Hey, there we go. Now our Estus Flask heals for more. Does anyone else notice that? Like that like people there's just like certain things that you can like you like, okay, everyone's gonna say this when they play the game. Everyone's gonna do that. Everyone, whenever pl they play a Mario game, they're gonna make like a mushroom, like on drugs, like mushrooms joke. Bad, bad. Oh god, I swear I'm. Holy shit, dude! Can you just attack me normally? Thank you. Okay. Did that dude just yeet off the? He did. Okay. This guy's gonna throw things at me because he's a bad man. No! What did my parry work? Or my repost, I mean. Eh, screw you, you got a slow weapon. This is the downside of having a slow but powerful weapon. Sometimes when you parry someone, it's just the repost just doesn't work. It's weird. Anyway, come here, dude. Come here. Okay. And I switched to two hands so I can get more damage. Let's see if I can do this jump. Yeah, yeah, I did it. Luckily, with Dark Souls Remastered, it allows you to change the uh, jump controls so that you don't have to double tap uh, dash. Um, you can just uh, click the stick in, like it's Dark Souls uh, 3. And Bloodborne as well? I don't know. Fun fact. Uh, Bloodborne was actually the first From Software game I played, which I... I think it's generally considered the, the hardest one, I think? I don't know if that's true, but, um, but yeah, it's definitely not an easy one to start with. Sorry, rat. Um, but it's the one that I played, and uh, I like it. I liked it a lot, and then after that, uh, my friend... My friend got me to play Bloodborne, and then... Oh, jeez, dude! Starting off with a home run swing. Sorry. There's this dude who plays Bloodborne. I forget his name. What is it? Uh, he, hey Zeus, here's Toast. And uh, he has this... Bad. Try again. There we go. He has this thing with the bosses when they do like a big like swing attack. He, he just calls it like the home run swing. Are you gonna throw stuff at me? Yeah. Sorry, dude. Um... So, I've kind of... gosh. I'm so bad at parrying, man. I swear. He calls it the home run swing. And I've just come to uh, call it that as well. You should go watch him. Watch his uh, 
Watch his uh, AGDQ or SGDQ of Bloodborne. He's got two of them. Just watch both of them. They're both great. There's also another uh, Dark Souls related thing that I think is the thing that got me back into doing Dark Souls. Um, cause, you know, I just played it once. And then I saw uh, Kraken and Tomato Gaming playing uh, like this Dark Souls enemy randomizer. And uh, that was really funny. I haven't even finished watching it yet because um, whenever I was watching on YouTube, um, they hadn't finished yet. Like they hadn't uploaded all the parts. Um, but that was really funny. I suggest you just turn this off right now. And just go watch them, because they are way more entertaining than I am. Uh, and they also, you know, edit their videos to to just have the funny bits. Um, I wish I could do that, but I have to have funny bits to begin with in order to edit out, edit them in. So, it sucks. Um, so you're stuck with me. But if you'd rather watch me, that's great. Um, I wouldn't recommend it, though. Okay. So I did a couple item randomizers, um, that's, uh, and those were fun. I put my own tiny spin on the randomizer, um, there's a certain character that we'll get to eventually that's, um, thank you, kind. thank you kindly, that we'll get to later that, um, uh, the character gives you, I think, three items? And I had them all set to be randomized, and uh, this little spin that I put on my randomized runs is that I try to get to that character as fast as possible because whatever three items that I am given, I have to uh, I have to use those items. Like if it's a weapon, I have to use that weapon, and I have to build my I have to center my build around using that weapon. Uh, or if I don't get any weapons, like I remember I got like a a blue titanite thing, which is basically just an upgrade material for certain weapons, like magic weapons, then I was like, okay, uh, obviously the character is telling me that I need to use a magic weapon and upgrade it. So uh, that's what I'll do. So that's what I did. That's how it made sense. Ah, uh, gosh. Uh, could you die? Thank you. Okay. So I did that. Um, and that was fun. I enjoyed that. See, jeez, oh, come on, dude. So 134 on a backstab without two-handing, 148. The damage increase isn't that much right now, but it will be pretty substantial eventually. Dude, come on. Okay. If you attack an enemy enough with their shield up, their shield will just break because they're they'll run out of stamina. So, hey, dude. No, no, damn it. Man. I feel like I'm not doing that much damage. That's because I'm not, because I haven't gotten my claymore yet. I need it. Also, I got the wooden shield. Like a couple seconds ago. And uh, the wooden shield just will, I think, forever remind me of uh, watching uh, Low Bro play Dark Souls for the first time, which is uh, Lobos Jr.'s brother. Um, it's really just. It was kind of, it was a little painful to watch, uh, I'll admit, but it's, it's, I mean, that's just kind of like the first, like, anyone first playing Dark Souls, like, even, like, <laughs> even me, the, uh, clearly the Dark Souls master, um, hey dude, just want this for no reason! Uh, <laughs> are they following me? Yeah. All right. Hey, dude. How's it going? Is your buddy following too? All right, yeah. Oh, don't. All right. I'm coming up there. Hello. Nope. Oh, well, all right. No backstab for me. But uh, I think Low Bro was, like, particularly, like, oh, to watch. But he, I mean, he eventually got it. And he, like, he, like does, like... He's a good like a like a Twitch streamer now, like his and he like he does streams of his own and he's he's like he's got it. He's done challenge runs that I wouldn't want to do, like soul level one and stuff. 
Dark Souls? Are they gonna... He turned right around. He turned right around because he's like, Oh, hello! You're, you're here. You want to go fight the Black Knight, and I am here to sneak up behind you and fuck you right up and not know how to path correctly. And... Oh, come on, dude. I don't want to go near you because I don't want to aggro the... Holy shit! Okay. Uh. Uh. Okay. I'm gonna drink. I wanna be <laughs> max HP for this. Yeah, low bro. Um, I just remember I didn't watch all of him, but uh, I remember I watched him fight Taurus Demon the time that he he, he beat Taurus Demon, which Taurus Demon's coming up. Uh, uh hey, hey, Black Knight. You, uh, you coming over here? Okay. And, uh, he was using a wooden shield, and he was, like, blocking everything, which is, you know, that's good. That's how he beat it. Uh, there's a far easier method. Oh, gosh. I'll get this, I swear. Just doing that, just so I can get my heals. Okay, that's 109 on the parry damage. It's one, or 109 on the one-handed. And 130. Okay. There's a much easier t way to do Taurus Demon. There's two much easier ways to do Taurus Demon. I will be showing you one of them. Ow! Oh! Black Knight Sword. Oh, I'm gonna use the Claymore though, because I said I was gonna use the Claymore. But oh man, Black Knight Sword though. Damn it. Ah. <laughs> oh man, I kind of want to use it. Ugh. Dark Souls is a very different game when you know how to parry. I'm clearly still not the best at it, but I'm way better than I was when I first played. Oh hey, I already have one of those. That's what I'm using right now. Hey friend. Yeah. It was a nice attempt. Come down here. Uh, okay, okay. Get him right in the dick. Right in the dick. Alright. I could go down there. That's the same dude down there. I'll open the door. Just cuz. Bam. We're not going down there yet, because I am going to get squished, because I am not that great at parrying that guy. Um. We'll do that later. There you are. Uh. No, no, no. No, no, no. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, shards. Eh, it's not really what I want. Damn. You know what sucks is that when I played this earlier on the recording that got all fucked, I was getting chunks. I got chunks from both those Titanite lizards that I killed. And I was like, that's pretty good. But hey, I mean, I guess I... I won't have to to buy as many large shards from uh, one dude, but I'll have to buy chunks now. I'm gonna heal to full just in case. And get my shield out. Come, fight me! Come hither! I need you to come right, right around here, if you don't mind. Yeah, that's... that's... Um, that's good. Right there. Okay. Alright, now if you wouldn't mind... Uh, you got- you have the right idea, but not- not quite what I need you to do. Yes, you're very strong. I think that'll be good. There you go, buddy. <laughs> yeah. So that was Taurus Demon. 
Another thing that you could do is you could climb up to where those archers were and kind of like drop attack him over and over again, which is, whoops, sorry about that. Oh, oh no, I'm using a mouse and keyboard because it detected that I had a mouse. So I should probably roll that up so I don't do that again. Um, you can just drop attack him a bunch, uh, which is what I did when I first played. <laughs> it's not what I'm going to be, that's, but uh, that's clearly very easy. And hey, look, it's everyone's favorite character. Oh, whoops. I was expecting yes or no question. There we go. Yes, jolly cooperation. Yes. Um. Like, that dude's lucky. He gets an amiibo. Speaking of amiibo. Uh. So, if you didn't. Uh, you probably know, but, uh. Dragon Quest Hero. You know, is in Smash now. And, uh. Also, that just happened. Uh, the reason why I walked is. Well, I'll explain it in a bit. First of all, Dragon Quest Hero is in Smash Brothers. And, uh. Oops, I'm not gonna level up. And, uh, you know, he's got the. He's got the 8, Dragon Quest 8, as a skin. He also has 4 and 3. Um. And 11. I guess 11's just the regular one, though. But, um. Yeah, 8 is there. And, um. I'm really hoping that 8 will get an amiibo, and it won't just be 11, but it's probably just going to be 11 because there's only, I think, male Corrin and male Pokemon trainer amiibos, and only Bowser Jr. amiibo, so... But I mean, Dragon Quest is really popular, and I'm sure they'd sell if they made them. Dragon Quest is really popular in Japan, let me say that. Hopefully it'll get more popular in the States. I mean, they're trying real hard. A Smash Brothers character is a very good way to uh, make something more popular. It worked wonders for Fire Emblem characters. Um, hello. I'd like you to go back to your spawn point, please. Thank you. Alright, now let's put this bad boy on. Oh, this is a badder boy, and I'd like to put him on, but no. Alright, uh, what are the requirements? I mean, it's 16 strength. Okay, that's what I have in 10 decks. So I didn't have to level any decks, so thank god. Um, if you ever have to level decks, just don't don't tell anybody about it. Um, that's, uh... Yeah, so I'm really hoping that... Okay. I'm really hoping that Tiro will get an amiibo. <laughs> Uh, dra well, I mean, I know Hero will get him, but I hope 8 will get an amiibo, because I would fucking buy that in a heartbeat. Uh, yes, so, now, I would like to get more strength. 20 is good for now. And vitality, 15, and then we will work on endurance, I guess. Okay. So let's try this thing out. Hey, dude. Pretty good. Now, what's really good about the Claymore, it's got, I think, two really good things, other than just being pretty powerful and getting a good reach. It's got a good running attack. And it has a good one-handed R1, or R2, which is just a stronger attack, because it's this, like, lunge stab. Which is good for narrow corridors, and getting multiple enemies that are in kind of, like, a line. Um... Yeah. There's also some Ratto friends if you go underneath the bridge, but uh, we can just avoid them by just running past the uh, big dragon man. Hey dude, come here. Come here. I need to repost you to see my damage. Pretty good. Alright, now this guy might destroy me. I don't know. I have a little trouble parrying him. Sometimes, so I'm pretty much just gonna run around him a lot. That's not right. Oh god. Alright, retreat! Can I get up here, please? Whew. Alright, that works. I need to be up here. We don't- I don't want to fight in there. Alright, dude. Okay, it- Alright. God damn. Come on. Oh, damn it. What? Okay. 
I'm doing a real bad job here. Wait, hang on. Oh, I know why. Hmm. I need to be naked. <laughs> I'm mid-rolling. I was like, why, why does my roll feel slow? There we go. Okay, take two. Come here, friend. Come here. Alright, whatever. Their post just didn't work. That's fine. If I get the Black Knight Greatsword too, I'm gonna be pissed. And I should parry that one, seeing as how I can't avoid it. Okay. You just fall down. I'm gonna drink. Jeez! Nice tracking! Okay, I've got time. I'm gonna bury this fool at least once, I swear. Once he... That attack right there is the... The... Oh. Um... If I come near you, are you gonna spin around suddenly and just... just mm, you, you definitely were... Okay. Shit! Nice! Nice. Alright, I need to stand my ground and, and just... Just get him. I need to parry him. I'm making souls, though, so long as I grab a... Uh, what am I doing? I need my shield. Okay. After that, I... S okay. Here we go. There we go. Fuck! Do the repost. Not that. I'm not gonna parry that, because if I miss, I think I'm dead, so... Alright. Come here. Do it. Alright, whatever. Yes. All right, one more. Drink, ah, not a good idea to drink, actually. Because I need to get my shield. Ah! Ah! Ho, ho, ho. Ah! Drink. I'm safe. I'm not safe. All right, bring it. Chunk! I'm chill with the chunk. I need those. So. That's fine. Alright, um. Uh, uh, can I level up? I don't think I can. I mean, it's not. You should at least check. <laughs> I'll just run past you. Hello, pig. We're not interested in the pig. The only thing we're interested in is running over here, picking this up, letting this lad activate this thing. Oh, God. Backstabbing this fool. Then raising this back up so that it can never be lowered again. Oh, hey, you guys were supposed to like running at me. Yeah, I kind of like that. Not oh, God. All right, whatever. They're just the spearmen. They're not going to dash at me. I'm fine. Right. They'll slowly make their way towards me, but I don't think they'll make it before I'm done here. Alright. Balder Knight. Goodbye, Balder Knight. I... <sighs> I grinded for that, the last playthrough that I did, because I wanted to use the Balder Sword. It took me quite a while to get that. First try. Ow. Ow. 
Ow, dude. Not cool. Ha! Huh. Oh, okay. Ooh, nice, shards. Eh, well, okay, whatever. <laughs> Alright, eh, it's time to do this guy. This guy's scary. He's, he's scary if you're bad, like me. Way too early. Drink. Drink of the cup. Okay. Okay, Firekeeper Soul and Titanite Shard. And there's that guy up there who scares me. I don't like him very much. Well, I guess it's not really him that scares me, it's his little buddies. But we're not going to deal with them right now. We're going to go over here, because we've got a fairly good amount of souls, and we have a sword that is in desperate need of upgrading. And we happen to have got, found some upgrade materials. And there also happens to be a blacksmith right here. Well. Hey, buddy. Uh, yes. Uh, we can... I'll buy two more. Pop. Uh, so we need five more shards to upgrade to plus five, because I think it's two more for this and then three for the final upgrade, so... But this is... This is fine for right now. Okay. And I'm still fine with being naked, I guess. Hmm. There are a couple things I could go do. I'll... Mm. Yeah, why not? I'm gonna push my luck. We're gonna go fight the big guy who I was too scared to fight before. Because uh, if we can get him to drop... Well, if we can... I mean, he's going to drop it if I beat him. If we can beat him... Which he's easy to beat, but I'm just bad. So... Uh, but I'm gonna try it. I've got nothing to lose except to one humanity, I guess. It's a tree! I mean, an int! Come on, drop some... No, not that. I don't want that. I want purple. Oh well. I already have the shield that I need. Now, I had trouble fighting this dude on my last, uh, well, whenever I was playing this earlier, by earlier I mean yesterday, um, when I was recording, I was having trouble fighting Lad, but, um, uh, hopefully it'll go better. I mean, it usually goes fairly well. I usually don't do as poorly as I did. But, um, it'll be fine. I just know it. It'll be alright. I'm not gonna try and parry him, because I'm garbage at parrying him. Um, so I am just going to try and roll behind him and backstab him. Which... It worked! It works! You can do it. This is what I'm gonna do. Alright, there he is! Hey, but, oh, hey. Um, oh, okay, I was like, is he not gonna fight me? Okay, 155 on the damage on the damage right there. Now, I don't want to lock on to him, because it actually... Locking on and rolling in this game is, like, wacky. It's much better in Dark Souls. <laughs> Three! Oh, oh, wait! Okay. 
um, it's gonna, like, make me, like, roll, like, into him, because the camera will, like, freak out, so I'm just not gonna lock onto him. Okay. Ooh, okay. Gotcha. Oh, goodness gracious. Ugh, oh, man. We're two strong dudes. Well, he's a very strong dude. I'm a very weak dude. Ugh, we're just fighting. One hit from him is certain death. But I think I got him. Yes! I got him. I can wear clothes now. Boost maximum equipment load. Yes, fast roll. Can I wear pants? Can I wear pants? <gasps> yes! Still fast rolling. That's all I really need, but let's see. Let's see. Can I wear gloves too? No. No gloves. Alright. That's okay. I mainly just want a shirt and pants to cover up most of my gross body. That's why I wear clothes in real life, too. I just have a gross, disgusting body, and I just want to... I don't want people to see that, you know? So I just, I just wear clothes. If I had, like, a... Like, a smoking hot body, I just... Wouldn't wear clothes at all. Some people do that. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, again, I just don't really like the gross zombie ness of the character that you play as. It's like, eh. If I make a character, like, if I spend a little time making him look good, which I didn't, because I know that it doesn't matter, um, then it's like, I'd like to see it. But you're gonna be dead most of the time. You're gonna be undead. You're undead the whole time, but you're gonna look undead most of the time when you're playing, so, you know. Dark Souls 3, uh, you actually get to look like your character the whole game. Unless you do the Yoel of Londor side quest, um, then you can look hollow. Um, but, well, first things first. Um, whenever I first played Dark Souls 3, hey, dude. See you. Um, whenever I first played Dark Souls 3, I, um, I found Yol and everything, and actually I have enough to buy some more stuff. Well, you need... I'll be seeing you there. Okay. Be <laughs> I was like, is he still shooting at me? I, um, I did the Yol stuff, and I was gonna use him to upgrade, but if you use him to upgrade, it activates the ability for your character to be, like, turn hollow if you die enough times. Um, I didn't know that. And I was just gonna use do the level because I was like, oh, they're free levels. But my friend who was watching me play was like, wait, hang on, hang on, don't level just yet. Wait until you're a higher level. Whenever levels cost more, so that way you you know you won't have to get as many souls. It'll be better. I was like, oh yeah, that makes sense. I'll do that. Yeah, good idea. Uh, little did we know that uh, Yoel dies after you beat Abyss Watchers, I think. So I was like, I need those levels now. If I could just go and he's just dead. I'm like, oh, shit. Well, fuck. But I'm glad that I didn't do it, because I would have been a gross zombie the whole time. Um, but even if I was, uh, the game gives you a ring. It doesn't give you, but it lets you buy a ring that lets you look human, even if you are hollow, which I greatly appreciated. Because I eventually did play the game again, and I was like, let me do this Yol thing. And then I turned into a gross zombie, and I was like, oh... I don't like that. I took this back to Firelink, didn't I? No, I don't think I did. Alright, I'm just gonna do it just in case I didn't. I don't remember if I did or not. Hey, friend. Oh, bad. There we go. Also, let me just try and defend myself right here. By saying something. Or clarifying something, in case you don't know. This game has, like, cued actions? Um, so, like, if I roll, and then I press the shield button, uh, I'm gonna do that, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you when during the roll I push the shield, or I'm gonna, I push the parry button, I push the parry button to do this, alright? I'll tell you when I do it. Okay. Now. See? In a suit, at the frame that I was able to do any action, 
it queued up the fact that I pushed parry, and it parried as soon as I could. So, whenever you see me block a hit, like the hit hits my shield and I block it, and then I parry, that's because I parried too late, the action was stored, or queued, and the first possible frame that I was able to, um, parry, um, it did it. So, it's like I get hit, and then I parry. So, that happens, that's a thing. And it, it's kind of sucky. It's, it's kind of... No, oh, jeez, okay. Oh, God. This is where I think the stabby will come in handy. Because I'll be able to get these nerds from far away. Yeah, triple kill. Alright. So, yeah. It can be useful if you want to, like, if you want to roll on the first possible frame that you can. Is it all of them? Did he fall? What a goober. Oh god, I'm not going down there. There's Balder Knights down there. I don't want to fight them, him and Balder Knights. I think he's coming back up. Oh god, I am not fighting on this stairwell. Fuck no. Ah! There we go. Alright, he's gone. I guess we can fight these Balder Knights to see if maybe they'll drop me a shard. Oh god, they're buffed. Okay. Dangerous game. We'll get that guy to run at us first. He always sees you. Okay. Alright. Come. Come, brave knight. Face me. Drop me a Titanite shard. Fuck yeah. Good boy. Because I've got one. I only need to buy two more. I think I can just buy them. But I'll, I'll fight these lads. Can I kill him with a backstab? E yes. Also, if, if you, I think, want to get better at parrying in Dark Souls, um, just a little tip. Um, don't have your shield up the whole time when an enemy's attacking you, because they will most likely do an attack. If you have your shield up, that cannot be parried. They'll just, like, bash you with your shield. It's an attack that's meant to do a lot of stamina damage. Um, so, like, to your shield, so it'll break your shield. So, oh, whoops. So don't have it up, because they'll most likely do that attack. So just, uh, have your shield down, and then as soon as you see an animation start, then shield's up. And then, if the attack is really quick and you don't have time to parry, then at least you blocked it. And if they're doing a big windup, you can wait for them to come in and then do the parry. Um, and that will... I don't need to go over here. I don't have the key. <laughs> There's a guy in there. He'll free himself as soon enough. Um, yeah. So, yeah, wait until you see something and then shields up. Again, and if it's a really fast attack that you don't have time to parry... Uh, if you can parry it, then just do it. Um, if you're fast enough, you have good enough reflexes. Then you'll. But if you can't, you'll block the fast attack. And if they're doing a wind-up, then you can wait and then parry, and then you're good. So you just want to do that so that you don't make them do the non-parryable lot of stamina damage attack. At least that has worked for me. And... I don't think we need to upgrade. I think we're fine. I can, and I definitely will be able to after I beat these lads. Assuming that I can beat them. Oh no. I'm gonna heal the full just in case. Alright. I'm gonna be skipping the cutscenes because it's I had to set this up in a weird way that makes it look weird and I'm sorry. But uh and I've seen these, so if you want to see them, you can look them up. Goodbye, tail. Goodbye, gargoyle. Breathe fire. Oh no, what are you doing? Don't do that. Goodbye. <laughs> okay. People say Dark Souls is a hard game. I'm just kidding, it definitely is, but... 
if you play it enough times, you kind of understand a couple of things. I'm still gonna die. I obviously already have died a couple times, so I'm no master. But, uh, yeah. I kind of know a little bit what I'm doing, so that's an advantage. Gonna ring this, and oh gosh. That means I have to go do. Actually, I have to do two things. I have to skip the cutscene. I have to go down the ladder. Also, I have a bad habit of um, getting distracted easily by a game when I'm playing it. So if I like start talking about something, like I'm talking about something really interesting, which is impossible for me to do. Here's Oswald, by the way. Green tree. Yeah. We just want to learn his gesture, which is the best gesture. And I'm going to buy a purging stone just to have, just in case, because I always buy one. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. I have a bad habit of, um... If I'm talking about something, and then something in the game happens that I'm focusing on, then I'll talk about that, and then I'll forget about what I was talking about before. I apologize. I almost did it right there. I was, just, I was like, oh, Oswald. Oh, he's interesting. Oh. Alright. So, yeah, I apologize if I do that. Anyway. Well. Uh... I need two. Okay. Oh, yes. Cancel. Yeah, yeah, yes. Good. Beep. Okay. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, no, 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 no. I can't. I can't do it yet. I don't have the large ember. That's what we're gonna go get right now. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we're gonna level up endurance. And, uh, we'll get vitality to 20... And then we'll just do strength. Okay. Now I got a key earlier, and we're gonna make use of it. Yeah. At least we're gonna try to. So we're gonna have to run past a couple of guys. You know, these guys. Hey, dude. Oh, God. Oh, leave me alone. All right, pick which way you turn in. That way? All right, I'm going this way. Don't shoot me. Pig? Ah. Ah. Oh, wait, yes, rest. <laughs> uh, why didn't you respawn? Or go back to your regular spawn point? You crazy. Hey, friends. Goodbye. You're, you're, you're gonna die, guys. I'm sorry. Or not? No? There we go. For safety. Alright. Now. We're going to an annoying area that has an annoying boss. Let's see how we do. Ah, shit. It's not him, either. Uh, open the door. Okay. Um, so in this game, there's something called counter-attack damage. Also, I didn't reinforce my Estus Flask. Oh, whatever. Doesn't matter. Counter-hit damage, which if you get hit during an action, say, like, ro uh, rolling or while you are attacking, or if you're running, then you'll take more damage. So I should have stopped dash or running whenever the dragon was breathing fire, because I would have taken less damage. So, yeah. Also, let's hope I can run past the stairwell. There's going to be these dogs, but luckily they're stupid! And they'll run right into this fire, you know, if, uh, if they see you. Um, hello, doggy. Oh, God, no, doggy, don't hurt me, please. Good boy. Good boy. All right, I'll, I'll fight this one regularly. All right, now, we, you know... You think that you're all good after you beat those dogs, but then these dudes show out, show out, show up, and they're gonna start being mean to you, 
and they they might throw things at you, but you can you can kind of just do the same shit, and uh, they will also don't don't get hit in the fire yourself. That's generally not what you want to do. If they run past you, then kind of just uh, move away. Oh god. There we go. Okay. This is bad. All right, I'm gonna have to do. Okay. Okay, that other guy got. Okay, so I got two of them. I got two of them by the fire, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, let's. Oh, let's see if I can do this. Let's see if I can do this. Got it. Somebody. I did it. Please let me out of here. I got the Some PewDiePie skip. Uh, I'm finished. How did the okay, so what that is... That saves like a few seconds, which is exciting. Um, basically, if you approach this door at a certain angle, slowly, and tap the, the A button, then you can open it while his dialogue is happening. If you just approach the door normally, then you have to mash through all of his dialogue before you can open the door. So it saves a couple seconds, but it was completely pointless in this, in this run, but I did it anyway. Also, let's talk to you. Brilliant. You opened the door for me. Thank you. I'm saved. I thought I might never escape. I am Griggs of Vinheim, mm -hmm. the sorcerer of the school. I am much obliged for your assistance. Thanks to you, I may now resume my travels. Ah, yes. It's good to meet you, Griggs of Myella Abbey. I, I mean, Angelo of Vinheim. I, I mean, Angelo of Myella Abbey. Wait, no. Griggs of Vinheim? Yeah, okay. Now we're not done with the assassins and the dogs just yet. As you can see, there's a sneaky doggy. He's he's moving real slow. He's trying to lull you into a false sense of there he goes. Full on sprint. Do it! Die. Good. Good dog. Okay. Aw oh, shit. Alright. Let's see if we can do this right here. Nice! Double kill. Okay, if he's doing this pose, do not attack him, because he will parry your ass. So instead... Okay, instead... In in instead... Instead, we're gonna die. Okay. I was gonna say, instead, I'm gonna bury him. Clearly not. I don't parry those dudes normally. I normally just, uh... Run past them. But I was like, eh. I'll beat him up. We'll run past him this time. Hopefully. It's gonna suck. It's gonna suck. But hopefully we can do it. I don't have that many souls, so it doesn't really matter. Okay. Fire breath. Don't move. Oh, wait, no. It's... The, it's... Ah. Oh, shit. I was gonna say it was the far away fire breath that I don't need to, to, to dodge, but... Clearly I was wrong. Oh, also, there's a fucking shortcut that I need to open up. I completely forgot to do that. So I'm actually thankful that I died, because I would have forgotten to... Actually, am I going to even use the shortcut? Probably not, right? I guess it is a little faster. Hello, lads. Don't hurt me, please. Let me rest. Ooh, did you see that? That arrow. It almost hit me, but I ducked under it whenever I was resting at the bonfire. Don't hurt me. Don't be mean to me. Okay. Doggies, no! Don't do it, doggies! Ha, ha. Ah! Oh, jeez. Ah, okay, got my souls. Okay, now we have to do a strategic dog attack here. Right now! Okay, we killed one. Let's just get him on him out of the way. Get out of the way. Get in the door. Okay, now this is going to be sucky. I'm just going to drink right away. Okay, never mind. A dog's going to dog me. 
ha. Drink. Fuck. Shit. Yeah. These two dogs are really tough. They're a pretty tough boss. Yeah. Those dogs suck. They're probably... They're a pretty hard boss. There's also a third guy in the room with two, like, swords, but he's just... He's just a trash mob that they put in there to, uh... Like, distract you. He's kind of annoying. But yeah. You really just want to focus on the dogs. Oh, nice! God. Okay. And we need to do the strategic dog kill again. Oh, jeez. We missed it! I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, nice. Wait, hang on. Perfectly uh, legit tactic, I swear. Um, my my dad works at. Um... Get let me through. Ah. Don't attack me right through the fog gate. I swear I will end you. Fuck. My dad walks works at From Software Company. If you save and quit, or not just quit, then um, you can stop that um, backstab animation that that guy was doing. It'll also reset all the enemy spawn locations, so yeah, you can use it. I really do, I don't even need to kill this guy, but I have to because I want to do a certain thing. Nice, good dogs. Bad doggies. Bad doggies. I'm dead again! It's weird that they put bosses outside of the boss room. Like, the boss is just more dogs. It's weird. Alright, I might... Oh god, oh that's bad! Alright. Okay. That's two dogs down. I'll... I'll just take care of these dogs. Okay. That should make things infinitely easier. These guys are not as fast as the dogs, nor are they as deadly. Yes! No! Oh. Hey, that's cool, dude. Uh, but, uh, sorry. That was too fast for you. Fuck! Get the fuck out of my way! Okay. Had it with your shit! Alright. I got one! I got one boss! Okay, I just need to get the, the last one. Are you kidding me? Yes! I got him! Okay, now it's just the trash mob. He's easy, though. He's... Okay, I don't... They just put him in here to just to annoy you. Oh, he hit me. Holy shit. Damn, man, he's got some range. Come here. Do a follow-up. Do a third follow-up. 
Ooh, nice. Oh, jump attack. Okay, I can do that. Yep, see, he's easy. Yeah, again. The boss... The boss is just those two dogs. And once once they're dead, then it's it's easy. It's just gotta take care of that dude. They give him a lot of health, and there's a guy right here that will just kill real quick. Okay. Hello. This is female undead merchant. She'll sell us stuff. Um, I'm just going to buy. Mm. One standard arrow. I typically. You don't have to buy anything from her. Um, I don't need that one arrow for anything. Um, but I typically just... She gets pissed at you if you don't buy anything. You don't have to. Um, but I typically just like to buy at least one thing from her, so she's not mad. Just to throw her bone, you know. She's living in the sewers. It's gotta suck. Alright. I'm gonna do this real quick. I'm not actually gonna go down this way. I'm gonna just gonna do one thing real quickly, like... Because it would be a good thing for me to do. I'm just gonna go grab something. This, yes, but one other thing. And probably some other things as well, because I'm a kleptomaniac and I can't help but just take everything that I see. In video games. Not, not in re real life. Yeah, like that's over there. This is probably useless. I'm gonna pick it up anyway. Oh, it's not bad. It's just souls. I can live with that. All right. Now these are torch hollows, which are the most dangerous enemies in the game. Hmm. They, they, that, that right there. That's the worst thing ever. We don't like that attack. The jumping attack we're okay with. Doing nothing is also good. Uh, can we get this guy? Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. Now, there are... There are more bosses down here. There's one. There's one boss. Okay. Oh! Wait, are you still alive? Oh, gosh. Alright, we got a boss. Okay. There's one more boss. There he is, right there. Right there. Okay, we got him. Now it's just this dude. And this dude sucks. Well, it's actually a girl. It's just a butcher. Again, easy. So, I mean, there's bosses. Okay. And what we really just want is this. Hey, there we go. And I'm just gonna do something just cause I can. Down here- oh, actually there's a good item. This right here. Spider shield. That's a good shield. There's also this big ass rat. That we're gonna kill. Because we're mean. 
And we're just going to pick up stuff in here. Actually, this was not planned, but I was just here, and I'm like, ah, I'll be fine. <laughs> I'll be fine. And I'll just go ahead and make a shortcut. There is a boss I could go fight, but it'll be kind of troublesome if I don't do something about a certain thing. So, I'm not going to fight him. I'm just going to... Oh! Okay. Oop. I'm just going to open this right here. There's a bonfire, not going to get it. I'm going to activate it, but I'm not going to get it. Act yeah, light bonfire. I'm not going to rest at it, though. Okay. Okay. So now we are here. And with that large ember that we just got, we can upgrade our weapon to plus five. Or, well, we have the ability to do so. Whether I have enough materials and funds to actually do so is yet to be determined. I also might be able to, with the damage that I have right now, I might be able to cut this dude's tail off. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give him one good hit. If I miss, then I'm just going to run. And if it doesn't work, then I'm just going to run. Let's see. I lied. I got two hits. Alright, I got it. Okay. And now we just need to quickly run to Andre. Oh, there's another thing we need to do as well. I'm gonna run this way, less Baldur. I got one's attention, but that's okay. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Everything will be fine, I swear. There's only a couple more things that I plan on doing. Oh, I hear him. Please don't deactivate the bonfire. Okay, good. Alright. Andre, I've got something for you that you might like. Uh, I could. Why not? Sure. Magnificent. I could. I hardly wait to get started. Claymore plus six. Oh, I've got four Titanite shards. Nice. So I can get it to plus seven, I think. Oh, plus eight. Never mind. Oh, the damage. It's it's good. It's just good. It's pretty good. Okay. All right. Now I can spend the rest on leveling up. Ah, uh, one more point. Vitality. Then I think we'll be good for vitality for a while. Oh, well, actually, there's some. There's one. Okay, I need to go do. Okay, I have my next move. All right. There's just a couple things that I'm gonna do. I have to do a scary thing again that I don't like doing, but I have to do it. I don't have to do it, but I have to do it. I did it decently well. Whenever I recorded this yesterday. Let's hope I can do that again. Hopefully. It requires us to first go back to Firelink. I could jump off there and go to a location, but that's not what I'm doing. I'm doing something else. 
I am going to first look over here and look, there are more people here. Like this lady. You are undead as well. Yes. Then we've no time to fraternize. Oh. I have my mission and you no doubt have yours. Okay. Alright then. That's I mean that's fair. Okay, we want to rest here. Alright, now hopefully I don't fuck this up. Here's the guy that was in the cell that I didn't bother freeing. And uh, we just kind of want to uh, do uh, this. Uh, trust me, he's a bad guy. Trust me. Just trust me. He actually is bad. Because if we did not kill him, after a certain point, he would have killed this this innocent young lady right here. And we wouldn't want that, because then our fire bonfire would go away. Also, reinfest, reinforce the flask. And also, put on our new ring, which will boost our HP, stamina, and load. Uh, but it will break if I take it off, but we'll never take it off, so. Oh no! I didn't grab the black leather stuff. Because I ran past everything. Oh well. I'll wear the hat. Why not? Nowhere, uh, nowhere close. Alright. Now we have to go to a scary area that hopefully I will make less scary. Um. Uh. uh what? That's weird. Did anyone else hear what sounded like a giant, like, serpent snoring? Or am I just crazy? I grabbed the binox, right? Yeah, I did. Okay. Alright. It's, they're very important. Not for what we're doing right now, but for later. Alright, this is a scary area, but we have to do it. Alright, we don't, again, we don't have to, but I have to. Ow, oh, jeez, skeletons. Come on, dude. It's not cool. Don't you roll at me. Don't you do it. I said don't do it! And don't you... Alright. We're going to be dangerous. And we're going to light the bonfire, but not rest at it. I don't think that we're going to be able to interact with this bonfire later for a certain thing, but it's fine. Okay, hey skeleton, goodbye. Alright. Let's do this. Don't roll. Okay, fine. Roll. Alright. Don't roll. Fine. Okay, whatever. Ah, oh, gosh. Good skeletons, okay. Ha! Ah. Come on, do it! Oh my gosh, why am I so good at not falling? <gasps> if you save and quit, then you go to where you fell. Okay, got it. Drink. And then we fall again. Okay, and then we drink. Alright. And now for the scariest enemies in ever in any video game. Hmm. Okay. No, 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 no! Notice how I am looking behind me. I am. Oh no! Holy shit, okay. Yes! Yes! Oh, they're coming! They're coming though! But I'm behind the fog wall. I should have waited to use that Estus because I'm about to take some fall damage. But you know what? It's all okay. 
really hard boss. weird. Which mask did I get? Yay! I can replace this. This makes you look stupid, but it also increases your stamina regen. Which is exciting. And it, and it stacks with the grass crest. Alright. Alright, now we have to do scary. Okay. Let's get the shields up. Okay. Alright, here we go. Don't worry. I, I think I know the way. I'll be your guide. On this wild ride. Oh, don't do it! Okay. Go here. Fall off here. Grab the humanity. Fall off here. And uh, go down this ladder, because I'm not confident enough of myself to know where to drop down. And we are going to activate, but not rest at, this bonfire. Okay. Climb back up the ladder. Alright. Oh, Jesus. Patches. Hey, buddy. No. Ah. Yes, yes, yes. I will definitely look off the ledge. Yes, I will. <laughs> there were Skelebros that they followed me down. I couldn't talk to him for very long. He pushes you down. Whatever. Alright. <sighs> oh, jeez. Okay. And this. This will save us. Oh, no, not that. Okay, there we go. Alright, the Skelebros aren't gonna jump down here, are they? Oh, hey, I know you. You're no hollow, are you? Nope. Thank goodness. Please be careful. There are two fierce hollows not far from here. They were once brave knights. My former escort. Who would let such strong spirits be hollowed so? Heavens, is there nothing, nothing at all to be done? All right, now just in case, because this kind of sucks. I'm gonna be doing it really cheesy. Well, not cheesy, but okay. There we go. There's one knight. There's the other one. Did he just heal himself? He did. Okay, I need to regen stamina. Because <laughs> I don't have my shield, so... Ah, nice. Oh god, no, don't, don't use teamwork. Don't do it. No, I need you both to attack. Ah, damn. Shit, that was up against a wall. Okay, I'm gonna heal. Because these guys are dangerous. That. Ah. Got one. Okay. Don't do it! Is that it? Did I get him? No, no, no. Okay. Got him. Okay. <sighs> Hate that. <laughs> Alright. But we're good. Alright. I freed them of their hollowing. You banished those two hollows, did you? Yes. Pains me to think of the trouble my failings have caused. I am certain that both Vince and Nico are grateful to you. Thank you so very much. Here, 
these belonged to them. You deserve them more than I. Thank you. I am certain that thank you. Alright. And now we get out of here. And we revel in the fact that we did not touch a bonfire. So we get to warp all the way back to Firelink. And use these souls. Strength. Okay. Alright. Now our job is not quite done. There's one more thing we need to do. Real quick. Okay, just need to quit the game real quick. Hello, friend. How are you? Hello there. I am if not Petrus, of course. Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, you wouldn't. You wouldn't mind if I. Uh... By the lords. You oh. I'm sorry. I'm... Oh no. So I'm sorry, Petrus. I'm afraid it can end like this. Yeah. He was a threat. I swear. Had I not killed him, he would have killed that nice lady that I went all the way down into the. Tomb of the Giants to save. So, yeah, it's it's widely accepted that he kills her because if you go and you kill those two hollow guys in the Tomb of the Giants, like Petrus was supposed to go with them, but he like fled. You know, um, she she makes it out, um, but then eventually she's killed. And if you kill Petrus after that, then instead of just dropping those two humanity, he will also drop one of her belongings. So, it's ex widely accepted, pretty much canon, that uh, Petrus kills her in cold blood. Also, there we go. I need I need to put the best gesture on. However, if you kill Petrus then uh, she gets to just be right here and pray and be alive. And I do this every time because, uh, I don't know, I just like to. Hello. I will never forget what you did. I am deeply indebted, for it was not within my power to save Vince or Nico. I cannot thank you enough. In case you have not heard, I am Rhea of Thoroland. I only wish there was some way I could help you. I'm inexperienced, and I only know the art of miracles. If that could be of any help, speak to me again. Would I mean, they can't, be but... Any help to you? I would be most pleased if that were so. May we discuss miracles, then? <laughs> I will learn your gesture, as it will be important later. And I will enter your covenant for a time. And uh, I'm not going to purchase anything from you, but uh, I'll look at what you got, though. You got Divine Blessing, which is pretty good. But yeah. Vince and Nico were fooled by a lout named Patches and turned into hollows. My prayers did them no good. It is my ignorance, my frailty that has sealed their fates. Perhaps Patches realized my weakness all along and thus made the decision to abandon me. I can hardly blame him now. Okay. Then be safe. Farewell, Varia Nox. Okay. I just like to save her every time. Just because. So yeah, I think that's pretty much everything that I wanted to accomplish in uh, this. It won't be too long. I think I did a lot of things faster this time, which is good. Um, I did have the first try, but I died twice getting to Dog Boss. I only died once last time. That doesn't matter. And again, yeah, I know I haven't uploaded in a while, but I just, I just figured this would be easy. Oh, little did I know it was going to be awful. But I was determined enough to try a second time. If this fucks up, well, then you won't see it. But uh, I won't be very happy. I'll put it that way. Uh, but yeah, that's, that's pretty much going to be it. So hopefully this works. So hopefully you actually are hearing and seeing all of this. That would be great. But yeah, I think I'm done. So, yeah.